Hey, Keith, how you doing? This is Daniel from Dream Marketing. I believe you spoke with Joe on the phone yesterday about sending you a short video about tips on how to grow your business online. I will do my best to keep this video short, but if by the end of this video, you think that this will be something that you will be interested in, please reach out to us at Dream Marketing because this is what we specialize in. And if there's anything that we can ask of you is that by the end of this video to please give us your feedback on the video and let us know what you think. So the three things that we, we will be going over is content, citations, and backlinks. So going over content, content would be anything in which you can see on your site. Here it includes the words as well as the pictures and what they're saved as on your site. And the thing about Google is content is king. The more content, the better. So saying the better, the, the more pictures that you have on your site, the better. The more description that you have of your product and your business that you have on your site, the better. And the minimum of, word, the minimum of words that they want to see on your site is 1,500 words. So this gives you a good chance to integrate a lot of keywords into your home page. And the keywords are important to having you being found on Google. And we got to make this important that the more keywords that you have, and I know it may sound, it may sound like I'll probably repeat myself, but it's very important for you to have these words integrated on, um, on your page. Because um, later on, when, when we're going over backlinks and we're going over um, uh, citations, you'll be able to see and understand more about why these keywords are important to having you being ranked and where your site stands and people being able to find you, um, people being able to find you throughout uh, the website or being able to come to your your site and, and, and grab products. So going over your site, my only suggestion would be from from just looking at it firsthand on end would be to add more content, you know, add more pictures, um, add more keywords. And, and remember, we were speaking about keywords, uh, basically add more in depth about um, being able to to get these keywords integrated into into your um, your home page, and like we said, this would be describing the product, what they do, what 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 they do, um, you know, and what they can do uh, for people. So this would be a good chance to being able to have uh, these things being done because this would give you a greater chance at being able to be found on Google and being ranked on Google higher because yours detailed. To give you an example, say you're against another site. The other site may only have but a few, you know, a few, a few things in which yours don't, but someone will come to your site or be directed towards your site because yours describes something in which they're looking for. So, like again, that that'll be the only suggestion in which I, I I'll be able to give you is to add more pictures and more keywords describing or or giving more about what your business does or more about what your product can do for people. So the next thing in which we'll be going over would be citations. So I did a quick search and the first thing that you will see will be this area. This area right here is called the map pack. And citations have a lot to do with that. Citations are basically your business name, address, phone number, uh, listed throughout different directories throughout the web. And what I mean by directories is places, that, places like Facebook, LinkedIn, Yelp, and sites like that that allow you to put in your information. And one of the first things you wanna do is look at your competition. You wanna see where your competition is being listed at in the directories. And what you wanna do is grab these same directories and add them to yourself. So for example, if your competition has 10 directories, you should have, you should have or want to add at least 20 to 30 more uh, than what they have. Not only will, will, will it help you div, uh, drive local traffic uh, to you, but it will also help you dominate the map pack section. So next, let's look at backlinks. Backlinks have a lot to do with this section here. This section here is called the organic section. And with that, the way backlinks works is that it's another site basically pushing your site. For example, if say you do business with a sub place, or you choose to sell your, your merchandise within or, your, or your, uh, your product within a sub place and they choose to share the link. They'd basically be pushing your site from their link, but basically it would do nothing for you because their, their site are basically all about sandwiches or their, uh, it's about food. 
And the main thing you want to get into or or be able to, to, to get healthy backlinks is with other people with say it's materials or bottles or things that push your site or or another place that may talk about and may talk about growing plants or may talking about uh, bringing other things into into the mix that'll be able to help you because not only will it help you uh, not only will it help you push your site but it'll send more traffic to you as well and get you better ranked on Google. So I want to show you a program that we use. Uh, that's called AFERS. So the thing with AFERS that that we're going to go over is kind of it's, it's it's a great program because it shows you uh, potentially where you can rank. And the, the thing that we love about AFERS is that it also shows you where you rank at amongst your competition. And basically, I'm going to show you where you rank, and I and I'm also going to show you uh, CBD outlet. Uh, outletting oil as well. So for the moment for Nibana Life, you have 15 referring domains, which are giving you 28 backlinks, which in turn, you only have one organic keywords, which like we say, keywords are very important, but it's driving zero, zero, zero traffic to your site. Now to go to CBD outlet and show you what, they, what their ranks are, they have 181 referring domains, which is giving them in return 1,000 backlinks, which is giving them 131 keywords, which are driving 181 people to their site a month. So let's take a look at the keywords that they're using. Once again, I want, I want to make it very important. Keywords play a big role in driving traffic to your site. And to give you a little insight, the more organic words that you have, which people are looking for, the more people will visit your site. A keyword has two components. You want to list the service or industry that you're in, but you also want to list a specific lo location as well. And let me see if I can find one to give you an example. Now, one of the ones in which I think would be best would be see because i don't want to take too long like for instance where can i purchase cbd oil uh cbd oil uh online shops and another one which i'm trying to find you to show you the best example would be so basically it would it, it would come out to cbd oils cbd oils in uh, pennsylvania or cbd oils in uh, the county or in the um, in the in the state or the the city that you're in, and those are some of the things that that you want to find that'll be able to drive people towards your site. So that's pretty much all I have for you today, Keith. And I and the team at Dream Marketing appreciate you for taking the time to look at the video. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. We would love to talk to you about it, and I hope you and your families have a blessed day.